Hello everyone, welcome. This is going to be a collective love reading. If you were drawn to the title, most likely there's a message in here for you. We're just going to look at what is going on with you when it comes to love, what's coming up, what are the predictions. So let's see what's coming up for the collective viewer when it comes to love. Romantic feelings single some of you are single we got reconciliation we got mask okay interesting some of you are single and reconciling with someone soon some of you are single and finding new love soon whatever the case is there's going to be some romantic feelings involved let's look at the energy between you and a person who is currently on your mind then we'll look at what's coming up for you in love overall so the person on their mind currently what's going on between these two what are the energies between these two this is someone you've had okay this person's viewing you as someone they've had a breakup with and they do want to come up out the cold with the five of pentacles in reverse. So this is the this person wants to reconcile with you. Some of you may be running from them because you want to heal. Ten of swords in reverse. You could see this person as the one who left you behind, walked away from you, and you're trying to heal from that. I see a lot of you wanting to reject this person. There could be a Scorpio, a Pisces, Taurus. A lot of Taurus energy. But my goodness. Some of you are starting to realize a lot of things throughout this breakup, like things that need to be healed, things that you want to work on. But I see this person holding on to you. <laughs> I see them holding on to you. What are the love messages for the collective? Secret admirer. There could be someone admiring you. Reconciliation again. Twice. Reconciliation. So either you you guys are going to reconcile or this person just really wants a reconciliation with you. We have fake it till you make it, pretending to be more than they are, keeping up with the Joneses, not allowing people beneath the surface. I feel like this is that X energy we got pushover. I feel like they are used to you taking them back, used to you welcoming them. And I feel like you're used to them kind of putting on a front. I feel like some of you do know that you have a secret admirer and you know exactly who it is or you just feel it. But I feel like you do and I feel like it's, I get a really good feeling from the secret admirer. I don't know why, maybe they're like, Maybe they're a big deal or they are very financially secure or they're adding, they'll be adding to your life in some way. I get a really good feeling from the secret admirer. So let's see. What is coming up for the collective when it comes to love? What are the predictions? What are the love predictions for those who chose this reading? You're definitely in this energy of taking back your power from a past person. So it's really not going to be easy for them to get this reconciliation that they want. Could be an Aries or a Leo or a Pisces again. You have the hangman as your overall energy. So you have this whole new perspective, seeing the truth about a lot of things. I definitely feel like you're in a strong position emotionally, you're definitely not falling apart emotionally. You're quite happy, quite stable, and you've taken back your power or currently taken back your power from someone. Um, this person is now seeing you as their wish fulfillment. This could be why they want to reconcile. They're definitely dreaming about you. 
And they're definitely in this energy of wanting to reveal their feelings. But you got the Ten of Cups in reverse. Yeah, this is a person you've had some kind of ending with. What's blocking is the Emperor. And I feel like that's you <laughs> blocking. Or it could be a person who you're meant to be with. Male or female. Someone very stable. Or it could be you, like I said. Because you're realizing a lot of things. And taking back your power. Taking back control. So it could be you. It could be the new person coming in. But... A lot of you are rejecting the, the past person. Even though I see reconciliation here twice. Your energy is more of taking back your power. So I don't know if... I don't know if most of you are taking this person back. Clarify the Seven of Cups, please. Could be a Sagittarius for some of you. But this five of swords though this person is i feel like the more you do take back your power the more they want to reconcile with you because they're seeing you as a challenge they keep thinking about this and thinking of ways to come towards you what to do why the strength clarify strength please so a lot of you are strong enough right now to step into new love or even think about new love you know when you're stuck in a situation it's hard for you to, to see yourself with someone new because it's the unknown and it's uncomfortable and scary i don't see you guys being stuck there i see you actually being open to like to like the secret admirer or new love or a new life just very carefree very strong in your emotions or you're soon to be you got ten of pentacles here clarify the emperor who is this emperor Some of you, the secret admirer could be someone that you already know or used to speak to. Maybe things didn't get off the ground. I'm getting specifically for some of you. This is a specific story. This could be someone from the past who you never, you were never with, but they weren't as attractive to you back then. And now they've had some type of like, because I, I don't know why I'm seeing, this is specific. So it's either for you or it's, or it's not. I'm seeing someone who is now muscly. Okay. Seeing someone with their shirt off. So some of you, <laughs> the secret admirer could be someone who used to be like not your type, and now they have transformed, and they are now your type. So yeah, doesn't have to be for everyone. Definitely not for everyone. But that's that's some of you secret admirer, someone you actually know, because I'm seeing this energy of um, returning or re reuniting. You, you and this person once um, separated or just went separate ways, had separate lives, dated other people, didn't really date each other, just kind of met each other. And now it's like coming back. So there's no like bad blood between you and this past person. Not talking about this one over here. I'm talking about this emperor who, who could be. I'm also getting that for some of you, this emperor could be you, but you had lost yourself. Like you had a separation with yourself when you ended up with someone over here. Cause you know how you can kind of lose yourself in a person or especially in a toxic relationship. This emperor could be you kind of reuniting with yourself. And that's why you've become so strong and in control because you now are back to being you and back to being in control. Um, clarify the five of swords, please. Yeah, I'm seeing, hearing what goes around comes around. Um, Beyonce, best thing I never had, that part. So you're definitely moving on, taking back your power. And it's like, it's just a part of the cycle. Now they're wanting to reconcile with you. Clarify the moon in reverse, please. Five of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. This person could be wanting to tell you about their insecurities or that they didn't have as much money as they claim to because remember we have fake it till you make it, pretending to be more than they are, keeping up with the Joneses, not allowing people, people beneath the surface. So when you see the moon in reverse, 
now things are coming out from under the surface and what's coming out is this five of pentacles so it could be that they don't have a lot of money that they claim to have they don't have the stability to bring to your life they could be a trying person never knock someone if they're really working really working on themselves really trying to better themselves but they definitely pretended to be more than they are whether it's financially or maturity level whatever it is hmm, so let's see clarify the, the nine of cups please yeah they see you as healing and they know that you have other options two of pentacles three of swords in reverse this person knows that it's a shaky time for them like <laughs> That they might not get this reconciliation because you're becoming way too strong way, way too wise what do we have for the collective what are the messages if yes luck is on your side cycles i saw this card when i was telling you about the wheel of fortune and this being what goes around comes around so we got calm uh, fate karma something ending something beginning This could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have narcissists. Someone is full of themselves. So yeah. They could have, like, this typical of narcissists pretend to be more than they are in the beginning. Literally all of them do that. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, this person could have done that. And you're basically just realizing that you were just dealing with someone who wasn't what they said they were and that's fine because you healed and you got stronger and you're just ready to take a new leap what do we have for the collective who chose this read someone is unhappy wrong time and place unlocked potential and you still miss me so yeah remember they're full of themselves so yeah they feel like you still miss them um doesn't mean you do but this person i do feel like they're kind of stepping into a position of stop like to stop faking it and to start being real and start really trying to better their life but it's just the wrong time and place like some of you have elevated above this person already it's really like whatever but for those of you who do want to reconcile with them they definitely want this but just keep that narcissist card in mind what are the love messages for the collective those who chose this read falling in love fear of failure date flirt play just for fun and overcoming challenge i do see you because we have romantic feelings whether you're reconciling with this person or you're falling in love with someone new it's gonna be good because you're in a strong position emotionally that's the key with the strength card is that you're not coming from a place of desperation you're doing what you're doing for yourself But this ex may have a fear, fear of failure, like a self-fulfilling prophecy or belief that things fail for them. That could be why they feel that they have to fake it till they make it. Definitely have some kind. They definitely have some kind of negative or insecure way of thinking. What's the advice for the collective? We have yes, you can rest and raise your voice. You can definitely speak up about what you want. I'm sure you know that. We have open your eyes to others. Sorry, open yourself to others. I see that you're doing that. Like I said earlier, you don't seem to be scared and stuck on one person. Definitely being more open. Clarify the six of cups, please. Yeah, some of you are still attracted to this person over here but you've definitely seen them as the knight, the knight of swords in reverse 
there's an the energy of you kind of missing them or reminiscing on the past but you're attracted to them is what i'm seeing some of you are seeing that they're growing and trying to trying to better themselves clarify the ace of swords in reverse A lot of you are getting over this. Ace of Swords in reverse, Ace of Cups in reverse, Ten of Wands in reverse, Five of Cups in reverse, and then we got the Eight of Wands. So it's like forward movement, getting over the past, letting go of the baggage. A lot of you are ending this, especially those of you who have already found a new love or you already know who the secret admirer is, and you're like, yep, I'm going for that. But I feel like even those of you who have no idea who you're going to be with next, you still have that strength and confidence to move forward with faith that someone is showing up. But yeah, this person over here is very unhappy. Wanting to come out of the cold, probably regretting faking who they are. But I feel like they, they didn't know what else to do. And it just kind of backfired on them. This may be just their way. They may not be able to bring you the stability into your life, and that's the truth, but they came towards you as a lie. They are trying to better themselves, but it's up to you if you want to wait for that, you know. So the reconciliation is on the table, but you don't have to take it if you don't want it, okay? But they are slowly bettering themselves. They're just not there as they made it seem. And you definitely have other options and especially a secret admirer already. So I hope this was helpful. Feel free to check out my other readings. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the notification bell so you know exactly when I post. Like if you enjoyed this. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.